have likely never seen distortion used like this. Let's say I want to be distortion on my drums. Take a listen how we start to clip our drums once the distortion is added. Wouldn't be great if we had something bring down the saturation at each transient and then increase it back again. That magical tool for this time is envelope follower. Map the saturation mob onto envelope follower. We are going to increase this one and decrease to the zero. So take a look at what happens to saturation button now. Now I want it to be a bit faster. What I'm going to do is increase the gain without dynamic saturation. Really cool, isn't it?